First possession picked up right where they left off. Aikman, Irvin, gorgeous connection, worth another look. Doug Evans with some terrific coverage on the part of the Packers, but Aikman and Irvin just too perfect there. However, the Cowboy drive would stall as it would all, win, all night. Chris Boniel from 45 yards away, he got it. 3 nothing Dallas. Next Cowboy, same score, Emmett Smith breaks one over. He's looking for daylight, and he finds it for 25 yards, a season high. It's 25-yard run for Smith, 76 yards and all in the night. Dallas wants another touchdown for the Packer 19-yard line. Aikman looking for Herschel Walker, who's wide open, but he just can't get it. Dallas leads 6-0 after Boniel's 37-yard field goal is second of the night. Green Bay got nothing. Tony Tolbert bats down Brett Favre's pass. The screen pass to Keith Jackson snuffed. Dorsey Levens gets the handoff and trips by himself. But Dallas and Boniel keeps going. 43 yards away for Boniel. He got it. 9 0 Dallas. Next drive, Dallas third and nine. Aikman finds the umpires back. So Boniel's had to come on for a 49 yard field goal. 12 0 Dallas. Favre has his pass batted down by Shante Carver. Dallas offensive corner to Erdy Zampisi. Looks like I picked the wrong week to stop smoking. Boniel again after another drive fails. 35 yards away. 5 for 5 in the first half. Ties an all time record for field goals in half. 15 0 downs. Reggie White frustrated all evening. Eric Williams contains him. Pushes him outside. Aikman is safe there. Again, White contained. Williams stuffs White at the line. No penetration. Favre frustrated as well. You saw Shante Carver bat one down. This time he just bats down Favre. Favre again. Under pressure, Broderick Thomas and Leon Lett meet for a loss of 16 yards. Favre sacked four times of the night. Third quarter, bad night all around for Green Bay. Pack trying to get on the board. A long drive, so they decide to go for a field goal. Chris Giacchiano, Boniel, you're no Boniel. Misses the 32-yard field goal. Late in the fourth, Boniel had a fifth field goal. It's sixth field goal. Now he's going for a record-setting seventh field goal with just 20 seconds left. The game no longer in doubt. The Cowboys wanted Boniel to get that record. However, the Pack were not too history-minded, giving the Dallas Cowboys an earful. Michael Irvin returning that earful. Barry Switzer amongst the scrum, not happy that his judgment was questioned about letting Boniel go for the record, which he did get. Dallas now tied in the end.